guys, it's me, your phenomenally talented pal, Gabe Rilla. And today, I'm driving to an apple orchard where I will drink an old beer and look at a fucking orchard. Enjoy. Faggots. Side note, if you say faggot in a YouTube comment now, it gets auto-deleted, even if it's on your own channel. Because I called a bunch of people fags with the shit the other day with people showing up on my channel, and... Uh, every one of the comments got auto-removed. They didn't even tell me. Which I thought was, uh, it's pretty interesting. Try it yourself in the comments down below. Type faggot. Type faggot. Okay. Hey guys, it's me, your pal Sparrow Medicine. Fuck. <laughs> your pal Gabe Rilla. And today, I'm gonna drink a, uh, don't mind the children in the background. Children are always pieces of shit. You know how it is. And uh, today I'm going to drink a Peter Hand Extra Light Special Pilsner beer. It's smoother and less filling. Now let me read you the little taglines on the side here. It says, uh, it's 96 calories, 0.9 grams of protein, 2.5 carbohydrates, 0 grams of fat, same as our regular beer. Uh, Peter Hand Extra Light is less filling, has a great taste, and is brewed naturally with the finest ingredients by the Peter Hand Brewing Company in Chicago, Illinois. It, Peter Hand Extra Light has all the flavor but one third the calories in our regular beer due to a special brewing process. A 12 ounce can of this beer this special Pilsner beer contains... Oh, and then it goes on to the carbohydrate part. I read that, that weird. I would guess from the riveting here, this is a early 70s or late 60s beer. I, you know, I can't verify that. There's no date on it. This thing is rusted the fuck out. Like, bad. Looks like a fucking uncleaned butthole. And, uh, let's get right into the news. Slight pop. A little bit of carbonation. Air damage you smell. Uh, I'm sitting out at a apple orchard and I'm going to let, let the air get to it like a nice fine wine. And uh, I'm sitting out in an apple orchard gorging, gorging myself on a little Concord grapes and donuts and uh, just got some cider. I almost said the company name. I don't want to get bitched at. Uh, Alright. Oh. Oh, that fucking went down the wrong way. Oh, that fucking hurt. Alright. Uh, it tastes like a very, very dark beer, which I'm guessing it did not initially. It actually tastes a little rusty, which is worrisome, but I've done that before. I don't think I'm going to die. Oh, it tastes like fucking coffee. It's gross. It tastes an intensely strong metallic taste. It smells like rotten metal. <laughs> this is what the inside of those grapes look like. Like a little, little snot. We'll get it in there and we'll just leave it there the rest of the day. Ready? Ready? Point it out, cameraman. It's on, it's on the table. My grape snot. Anyways, back to it. I mean, I'm imaginative I've drinking a cup of coffee, which makes it not that bad. This is a particularly chunkless beer, knock on wood. So take a look in there. Yeah, wow. The inside of this can, I don't know if you can see it, is spick and span clean considering the rust on the outside. Hope you can get a view of that, that's pretty interesting. I mean, other than it tastes like coffee, it wasn't too bad. Uh, anyways, yeah, uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. And Roboto will be back in my videos in a couple weeks. He's gonna get together with me and shoot a couple things. That'll be cool. And other than that, yeah, uh, it seems like everybody kind of enjoyed that. And I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.